I am an event producer and um, I've been producing events since the Olympics. My favorite part of the job is watching my client walk into the room and go, wow. And at the end of the night, just them not wanting to get off the dance floor or leave the room or being so enthralled that they just want to relive it over and over and over again. That's my favorite part. What is your poison? Oh, dark chocolate. Okay. I can't stop. We've got a desk down there that's specifically just for chocolate. It's our dirty little secret here. We have a snack drawer, uh, a snack table actually I should say. My zodiac sign is I'm a Capricorn, okay. which a lot of people would say of course you are. <laughs> because, is that relative? Yes, very. I work hard and I don't let up. So if there is something that I'm going for, I don't let anything stop me. You know, you have to be ready to put in the long hours and you have to be ready to battle through the challenges and you have to be ready to pull the all-nighters and go uphill, essentially. Women have this innate ability to do all of those things. We've had that for centuries and centuries and centuries. You know, we're able to be moms and we're able to provide for our homes and we're able to, you know, work full-time jobs and we're able to do so many things all at once. To me, a girl boss is someone that works really hard at what they love to do. And it doesn't necessarily mean that they have to own their own business. It doesn't necessarily mean that they have to um, be a top leader. It just means that they, 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 they're confident in, in the, who they are and they are driven and dedicated and determined to whatever cause or whatever work that they are dedicating themselves to. I think my biggest piece of advice is to do something that you are going to love doing the minute you wake up to the minute you go to sleep. Making sure that you are passionate about it and making sure that you are happy to do it because in those moments when you are running on like 30 minutes of sleep and you're heading to the airport because you've got to load in a gig in a city three hours away but you still have wrap up to do in the city that you're currently in, um, you have to be ready to just love it for, and embrace it for everything that it is. Yeah.